after multiple losses like that, you tend to sit on your hands and shut up. We're not seeing that. We're not seeing the silence. We're not seeing the humility. We're not seeing the, you know, the vulnerability that he put on place to put himself in a, in a position where you may or may not win. You're not exercising the vulnerability that, yeah, you just showed that you the, you lost. This is this is the game. There's a position where you get smashed sometimes, and you have to accept that as a fighter. That is part of why we do martial arts, is to accept the losses and the wins and grow from them. When you don't accept these losses, how do you grow? How do you fill the gap? How are you making adjustments to what Kellerman was saying? If you're not accepting the losses and you're pointing the finger and say, they did it to me, you're not adjusting. There's been times where I've felt not right with my stoppages, but I still take responsibility for the loss itself. I still put myself in that position to lose. And when you take responsibility, you can start shifting from the loss. We're not seeing that. And that's why what I think is going to stop him the most from succeeding moving forward.